My name is Rick Martin and I'm a co-founder at Decaf. So essentially we're a platform focused on uh, remittances and payments using blockchain. We have a wallet and a point of sales. Uh, before I was in Colombia, saw a lot of use of Bitcoin and uh, crypto as financial tools to, to move money across uh, like Venezuelans moving into Colombia and, and abroad um, and not having any options to spend their crypto on everyday life. The first house I lived in, I lived with a guy and I couldn't believe what he was doing. I had to see uh, millions of dollars of cash in Colombian pesos sitting in a vault to see that it was real and him driving backpacks of it out with teams of Colombians going to pick up points for, Colum uh, for Venezuelans crossing the border who could only bring digital money, which was Bitcoin, into the country. They had nothing, they couldn't get a bank account and he was giving them and buying their Bitcoin off them, selling it to Americans. There's millions of dollars every month to, to Venezuelans that had nothing but Bitcoin in, in Colombia and needed to live, right? And uh, this was a real need, like a dying need. And that's why I was like, well, why can't they just spend their Bitcoin? And we decided, well, you know, why are we here? What's the point of all this? Let's actually do something that helps people where we are which is in Latin America. And so we thought, okay, well, let's do payments and remittances because this is what we want and this is what people we know we know want and need. Decaf is decentralized cafe. Cafe in Spanish is coffee. It's the whole idea of being able to use your crypto to, to say, buy something like a coffee. And yeah, if you think about those those Venezuelans that were coming over, imagine if they could have used their crypto to buy coffee or, or food or, you know, this is the whole idea and it sort of stemmed from that. With Stella, it, the technology is super efficient, um, you know, and it costs nothing to send money abroad or do a transaction, which is really attractive. Uh, the speed is really fast, but the real beauty of Stella is not just the technology, it is also that it is trusted, that it also has a hyper focus on financial infrastructure or providing really valuable financial tools to people. and. That cannot be understated and for us that was the real moving factor or factor that made us come to Stella. I see uh, Decaf as the platform or the interface that just helps people access this uh, when maybe they would never had access before. When you talk about human potential, when we talk about giving people equal financial access, the limits are endless. So it, it, it really sort of opens up opportunities in so many ways for, for human potential. I think the end goal is obviously financial inclusion. I think that that really means, um, you know, cheap access to people of all geographies or as many geographies as possible. We have the whole world of blockchain and crypto unlocked. We have all these tr things that in traditional finance might have only been uh, uh, accessible by the rich or the private wealth clients or things like that. And, and now it can just be to anyone like a person who had, couldn't even open a bank account and i think that is really the true nature of the the extra value that this whole new industry can have and things we can't even imagine and and think of now which will be realized in those next years